Also developing this noon, a big shakeup at Philadelphia's School Reform Commission. Governor Tom Wolf has replaced Bill Green as chairman with a longtime educator. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Patterson joins us now from the school district building in Spring Garden with all the development. Steve, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Pat and Yuki. This morning we had a candid conversation with the outgoing SRC chair. He called his removal standard operating procedure for a governor that doesn't quite align with his worldview. Says he's not bitter about the reassignment, but also says the governor is doing something illegal. He has to do what is in his conscience, and I have to do what is in mine. One day after school reform commissioner chair Bill Green dropped the bombshell that Governor Tom Wolf is replacing him as chair, Green says he understands why. It's not terribly surprising. Uh, the governor focused on education uh, when he was uh, running and um, so having someone more aligned with his worldview as chair of the SRC, I can understand why that makes sense for him. But Green says that doesn't make it legal. Sunday, the governor's office announced they would be removing Green in place of fellow SRC commissioner Marjorie Neff. This comes days after Green voted to approve five new charter schools in the district, a move insiders point to as an act of defiance. Wolf didn't want new charters. A spokesperson for the Wolf administration says the move is about performance and giving Philadelphia school children a new direction. Green calls the demotion political punishment from the governor and he's gearing up to challenge its legality in court. It was a uh, sop to his financial backers who have a national agenda that is anti-reform. We'll go to Commonwealth Court and the court will tell us what the law is and we'll all abide by the law. Green says he and the governor had a phone conversation Sunday night, says that phone conversation was cordial and the two men respect each other, but he also made his intentions about challenging that decision quite clear. We'll have more tonight, including what he's going to do to work alongside the SRC before the courts make a decision. Reporting live from School District of Philadelphia headquarters, I'm Steve Patterson, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.